10 frog jumps and her feet are pointed. So we're gonna do 10. And we're gonna stop. Let's take a rest. No, no, don't stop. Take a rest, take a breath. Yeah, good. All right, do another 10. Yeah, point your feet. Yes, very nice. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Stop. Good. Take a breath. No, don't stop it. Too. So the frog jumps are good for your whole body. It's good for your thighs. It's good for your stomach. It's good for everything. It's good for your brain. Actually, they say that there's uh, endorphins that are released when you do frog jumps that are really good, makes you smart. So we'll do 10 more, okay, and go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. The higher you go, the better. Eight, nine, 10, okay, stop. Those are frog jumps, okay, stop. Okay, so everybody has a wall at home. We're gonna push off your wall, push off, good. It makes your upper body stronger. Three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good. So we're gonna take a rest after every ten. So we do sets of three. Okay. Yeah. So we're gonna do another set against the wall. And one, two. Good. Nice. Bend those elbows. Three. Put your chest nice and close. Four. Push harder. Five. Six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Good, Jace. Good stuff. All right. And we're going to do another set of ten. Last set. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good. So every set of exercise you do, so after every set of three exercises you do, you're gonna do a one minute rest. All right. Um, stop. Okay. So Jace, you're gonna have to, you come down from your handstand. Okay, because some people don't know how to do handstand. I'm gonna have them find a wall in your house someplace, put a pillow on the floor and try to kick up. So if you kick up, Nice and strong, keep your arms nice and strong, push through the floor, point your feet, good. And see if you can hold it, challenge yourself, see if you can, as long as you can hold it. 10 seconds is good. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good, come down. All right, and we're gonna do 10 tuck jumps. Go ahead, bring your knees right up to your chest, good. All the way up. Nine, ten. Okay, good. We're gonna do three sets of ten. So you take a rest after the first ten, and then you do two more sets. Okay. Are you going to do it? Yeah. <laughs> Why don't you do it? <laughs> this is going to be mandatory parents need to be in shape too you can't just be on lockdown and not exercising everybody and go one two three four five six seven eight Nine, ten. Good. Rest. <laughs> you know, we are really on quarantine, if you think about it, because we're the only ones here. <laughs> hey, you look my uh... Yeah, that's cool. Get your hazmat suit on. <laughs> okay. All right, one more set, Jace. Let's go. And... Go? Yep. One. Two. Three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good job. You're gonna walk up to your be in plank. Walk 
straight legs to your feet, walk out into plank. Walk straight legs to your feet, walk out into plank. Straight legs to your feet, good. Long line plank. Don't bend your knees when you're walking. Try to keep those legs nice and straight. Good. And you're going to try to do that as much as you have space in your house. Go back and forth. Straight legs. Good. All right. Good. All right. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze your stomach. Squeeze your stomach. And I want the parents to do this one too at home because it's really good to do, right? You're going to do this, Julius? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, sure. Yeah, he will. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Five, four, three, two, one. Relax. Good. So we're going to do this three sets, just like everything else. Again, Jace, let's go. One, two, hands up. Three, four, five, six, squeeze. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Good. And relax, and one more. Hold one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good. And to challenge yourself, I think most of you, nearly all of you, can do this. Is uh, scissors. So you're gonna hold it up, and you're gonna do a count of scissors. So let's go, Jace. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten. Scissors. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Relax. Good. Some of you can do double. You can challenge yourself by doing scissors and go right back into V sit, or you could do it three sets. We're gonna do another set, Chase. Let's go and up. One, two, three, four, five, six, can I do seven, double? eight. Nine, ten, sure. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Scissors. Oh, yes, very good. So she's holding it. She went right from scissors back into V sit. Holding eight, nine, ten. Scissors. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good. And that will help your core, make you nice and strong. Okay? you to make sure you work on your feet because this is very important a lot of students don't point <laughs> keep those knees down knees got to be down feet got to be pointed and just work this okay now flex good flex it all the way back all the way back your feet all the way back nice stretch yes and point good and flex and point make sure you can have somebody do this with you at home push down your feet Make sure to keep pushing down your feet, but make sure your knees don't pop off the ground. That's important. Make sure the knees are straight and flex. And point. And flex. And point. And flex. And point. Good. And just keep on doing that a few times. Make sure that the feet will or practice feet turned out, not turned in. Make sure your feet are never like this. This is wrong. This is all wrong. All wrong. Everything has to be turned out. Okay, now against the wall, Jace, really quickly. You know how you do splits against the wall? Everybody has a wall at home. Did we do, did we do splits? We didn't do handstands, yeah? did we? No. Yeah, we did. We did. Okay, so against the wall and splits. You know how you do when you the, lie down? The lie down ones. Yeah, the lie down ones. Yeah. Okay, okay so Jace is in splits right now. Knees are never popping off the wall. You can keep this like this. The, I would say if you have the music on, keep two songs on and stay like this as much as you can. The longer you stay like this, the more flexible you can become. You can push it down after a while. Make sure the feet are pointed. See this foot here? It needs to be turned out, right? We're never going to be like this against the wall. Feet never go like this. We turn out and stretch out. Knees are against the wall. Back of the knees are against the wall, I should say. They never bend. And we straighten them out and we keep it, we keep her like this for as long as she can take it. <laughs> Maybe for the first song, if you play a song, for this first song you keep it like this, and then you can start pushing her down after some time. You get more and more flexible, right? 
Great legs. I'm gonna go hold our bridge. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Relax. Good. Okay, we're gonna go into bridge again. This time we're gonna keep our feet together. Okay? And let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good. Up. Good. Make sure when you come up, your hands are in front of you. Yeah. And one more set. Feet together? Yes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good. And up. Hands up. Ooh. Make sure that you ground your feet into the floor so that you don't wobble when you step up. Um, we can try some walking bridges too. Walk back and forth in your house in bridge. Hi. Good. All right, and go. Walking towards me. Good, good. Good stuff. Good. Walking bridge. Six, seven, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Good girl.